Rose Gandaria, please report to the principal's office. So I came to Bowie High School. I wanted to try a little bit of everything. I had come from AOI Roosevelt, Guillen. I was a cheerleader at Guillen, so I was actually didn't come straight to Bowie High School. I went to El Paso High for six weeks. Um, my brother bought my mama house in the El Paso High area uh, right after, right that summer between my eighth grade and freshman year. So that was my home school. I went there for six weeks. I was miserable because I had my friends down here. So my brother and my mom actually had to go speak to, I believe the assistant superintendent was Mr. George back then, and they had to go speak to him to, to get a transfer back to Bowie. I tried tennis, cheerleading, ROTC, student council. Um, my senior year, I was a writing a peer tutor in the writing center. Uh, so just a little bit of everything throughout the years. I was a cheerleader, band, just different things. Yes, I remember Paul Stralsen. He was my principal. He was always out everywhere. He was at all events, sporting, academic, anything that was going on, he was there. Um, at lunch, he would always be out, hanging out with the kids, talking to us, seeing how our day was. He was just a really good principal. I think my favorite memory of Bui High School is when I was named um, the Bui Fiesta Queen. It was an amazing experience for me. Uh, we had a big party, the coronation, the dance, representatives from every club on campus, uh, the bow and the sweetheart. So I think that's my favorite memory from when I was here. It was always my dream to come be a principal at Bowie High School. Uh, when I started education, when I got my administrative degree, I always said, you know, it'd be really nice to go back to Bowie. And I'm a single mom. And so I had always said, when my son goes to first grade, I am going to apply to be a principal. But then he went to first grade, and it got harder because he wanted me home earlier, more often. Mom, where are you? He could call me at that time. So the first time, about eight years, nine years ago, I said to someone, you know, when Bowie High School opens, I'm going to apply. Uh, so I applied at Guillen Middle School last summer, and I did not get the job. I was a finalist. But God works in mysterious ways because I always wanted to come back to Bowie. And that opportunity was open this summer and I applied and here I am today. So I'm very grateful and humbled to be here to serve the community that I came from. I think because the fact that I grew up in the area, I grew up on Third Street and Florence Street, I think I relate to the kids. A lot of our kids are still going through a lot of the struggles that I went through when I came here. So I think the pride of being a Bui alumni is, is just in everyone. You see people everywhere wearing the Bui caps, the Bui shirts. Um, sometimes at Disneyland, I remember once I went to Disneyland and there was a couple there and they were wearing blue shirts and I said, hey, what year did you graduate? And we started talking just because, you know, of the connection, just being a Bowie alumni, it's a big family. I am so happy to be here at Bowie and I want my students, my faculty to know that I am here for them and I am here to help make them successful in anything I can do. My door is always open to, so they know they can approach me at any time and, and I want to, to just let them know, you know, if you see me, if you need anything, even if it's not school related to, to the kids, I say, come and talk to me, we, we can help you, we can find a way to help you with whatever you need to overcome at that moment.